Right, this is PXX RPG Queen, otherwise known as Hikari Silver, bringing you guys another amazing Let's Play. In the last episode, we basically faced Miranda's demons inside, which is making me have some theories about what's going on with the moon. Um, one of my theories is that since the moon that never sets is the flesh of the God of Destruction, that he somehow consumed its psyche consumed our wills or something like that, but it's very confusing. So it's basically showing us what's inside of each person's heart. So everybody's about to go through a trial. So for the time being, I am going to change what Hashel is wearing. I think Hashel should wear a therapy ring. So we're going to take it off of Albert for the time being, just to be fair. Because I believe he's the next one with the trial. So now we're gonna go figure stuff out in this weird, 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 weird world. Ooh, look, dress. Downburst. I don't think that's useful. Don't really think that's useful in the slightest, to be honest. All right. Ooh, what is that? That is the furthest thing from a unicorn I have ever seen. Minus the horn. Where's the pretty, like, face and elegance? Like, that That looks like a horse with a horn on its head and it's been on crack and it's about to attack. There we go. Die. Kill it. Thank you, Rose. Okay, so we have roughly about 10 more, 11 more videos before the end of the Let's Play. I'm starting to feel it now. And I don't want it to end, just like I didn't want Yu-Gi-Oh! to end. But that's a, that's a good thing about a series. Like, if it was a good series, you don't want it to end. But at some point it does. Okay, wow. What is this? We gotta go forward anyway. Yeah, I wouldn't contemplate this much more. But the heartbeat thing, he's getting old. What the hell? There are people. What's going on? Why are people living in the moon? I still don't know, but... Rose, what are you doing? You feel pain. It is certain this is not just an illusion. This world is reality. Indeed, I've never visited the moon before, but I cannot help but feel I know this place. People's faces, clothes... It's not a mistake. This is a building in Sidereo. I have traveled all over Indonesia, and they have typical Sidereian faces. Look, the girl over there. Look, Sidereian. No, she's not. It cannot be. What the fuck? Disappeared? Is reality here too. Very sad reality nonetheless. Okay, so we're in Sidereo. Uh, so there's inns. Uh, what is this? Items are very important. So, well, so let's take a chance to look at what kind of items we have here. Uh, honestly, I can sell a couple. Sell that. And hang on to Moon Serenade. Um, okay.
this tune is this tune is <sighs> yeah I'm a solid believer that they are related somehow a weapon shop we have purpose here Becomes powerful universally to HP. I wonder what that means. So, Basher will arm it. Red Dragon armor. Yeah. Gold. King Violet. And Dark. So just make sure I have all of the Dragon armors because they're the most powerful ones. Yep. So we're good in that department. I didn't see what else he had for sale either, unfortunately. I don't need any of these things at the moment, so we're good. I wonder what this guy's got to say. <laughs> I am a son of the most wealthy house in this town. <laughs> Come on, I'll treat you to spirits. Well, don't worry about money. It's on me. I'm a rich man. You all. Dread, aren't you? Indeed. Do you know him? Yes. If he is my old acquaintance, this must be Belay 20 years ago. What? I wonder what happened to his money. Well, it's only a simple guess. So let's go see what this little girl is leading us to. Now that we've uh, stocked up on everything. Some weird shit going on here. I understand that this place is not what it appears to be, but where are we now? A world behind the wall. It seems as if the labyrinth of the moon is not refusing us. No, almost as if it's maybe inviting us. Mementos, it seems this place belongs to them. I think they were the 99th species. Maybe they can tell us something about this place. Well, I don't normally encourage talking to NPCs, but let's see. The psyche is creating this world. This time, it's whose heart, whose intention. Is it you, or you, or maybe me? Okay, so this is the god of destruction's mind that's creating this world. The time, the space, and whoever's intention is in it, so... so it basically in has engulfed everyone's heart and is projecting it into this world. The heart is the world. The world is the heart. The created world has your color. Yep. That's what I thought. Let's see what this memento says. You don't see people who you shouldn't see. You see people you have to see. You have to see so that you see. You have to see so you see it. Yeah, my theory is right. Whatever intention or things that we are carrying around in our heart is being projected in this world. So let's... And if it's Claire, that's what's being projected into, uh... Dart's... Not Dart. Hashel's mind. Well, we'll probably come back to that later. Let's go this way. It would seem that Bale is a safe zone. Well, let's kill this thing before we talk to Claire. Hey. Ha. 
Um, oh my gosh, I can't kill anything here. Yes! Tap! Go! Tap! Tap! Go! Yay! We killed it! I would love to finish this edition correctly without Ultimate War God. I would feel so accomplished. Hmm, Burning Wave. Yeah. Let's switch it with something. Alright. So actually guys, I'm going to end the Let's Play here. As always, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Like me on Facebook, really like me. Follow me on Twitter and check out my blog. And stay tuned for next time when we basically face Hashel's...